Uh, right. The theme of this stream. Um, get your disappointment ready. Uh, mistakes. I messed up the stream when I started it. Tried to stream this to you stream. Uh, mistake number two. Play Cold War Enhancement next. Also, I had three feet of snow outside. I wish I were you. I wish I were you. I wish I had snow. Uh, I also wish I saved. Uh, we lost about six months of prog. You can see here that it's basically the same situation. Austria's getting fucked. It's slightly before Prussia, before Spain got popped out of Prussia, so maybe we could solve that situation this time around, but, uh, yeah, we didn't save. I didn't save last time, apparently, which is fine. Yeah, see, now technically we could try to keep the Spanish, but fuck that. Um, other than that, hey, how are you? Wait, Spain is Prussia now? Well, they were they were Prussia before. They're a puppet of ours, so it said that. But then we lost them. But then we went backwards in time through the power of incompetence. And now they're back to being Prussia again. Until the rebels here take them over and regain their freedom. Technically, we could probably kill the rebels. If we took them... You know what? I mean, why not fucking give it a shot? Because we could do this. I still can't believe... The Papal States is in the is in the fucking Great Powers, right under the Ottomans, who are still in it. Okay, but here's here's what we'll do. Spain, can I command your? Okay, it's got to take a day. Um, so a little bit of a repeat of what we've got to accomplish here. A little, I'll need to get accustomed to what we're doing here. It looks about where it was. And another thing I realized, as I wait for a, for a word from our sponsors. Person more like a ha 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 ha. One thing I've realized is, uh, before when we ended this, I was kind of, I thought we weren't doing very well. I thought, like, we had kind of fucked up, because if we look at what we can get from Austria, it's, like, garbage. We don't actually get anything out of it, except a couple of dollary dues, and, like, them not, and it's shit. We don't, we can't even cut Austria down to size. We have no infamy to add, like, fuck all. We declared this war to take someone out of their sphere who is no longer even in their fucking sphere. Seemed like there were a lot of problems. BRBBB Yeoman Manor Dick is yum yum in the tum tum zoo wee mama. Why do I leave these on? Uh, so I thought it was going pretty badly, but then I realized the whole fucking point of this is just to cuck Austria into not being a great power anymore, so then we can sphere them. And for some inane reason, I was thinking that we needed to spit out the people that they have sphered, because that's what we declared the war for. That's f the stupidest fucking- the entire point is to make them not a great power. At which point, everything they have sphered will just spit out by itself. I don't know what the fuck I was thinking. It's like we're actually in a good position. Ish. I thought we were in like a terrible one though. Now we've made mistakes. Uh, clearly we've made a lot of mistakes, but... Um, it's not unfixable. Um, are these guys both good? What was that even? <laughs> Music is low. Okay, alright, I'll trust you. I'll turn it up a little bit. You're right though, this is kind of a quiet song. Ooh. Ooh. Smooth as hell. Eh, about that level. So, uh, I think this is where we turn this around. And we... We made the mistake of trying to take Spain. We're going to lose it again. We have to relive that nightmare. Um, the Netherlands we might be able to keep. We might not. A lot of mistakes. But Austria is going to go our way. Um, you guys both go there, but do it separately. And you also go down there. You start sieging there. You are fine. Netherlands is helping. Sardinia Piedmont is helping. These things are still free, which is great. We want to make sure that that happens if we can. Have some music, hey, Tingo Scrap. Pa, pa, free yeoman is gay, lol. What am I, what? <laughs> thanks, thanks for the pennies, I guess. Let's get this going. Portugal defaults. Fuck you, Portugal. Um, we, yeah. 
Yeah, okay. Uh, we wanted to try and... Yeah, the o Austrian Empire wants peace. That peace isn't going to come for years. I'm done with the Audiism for now. Thank you. That's great. That's good to hear. Good. I'm happy you've cured yourself of your severe autism. Let's uh, try and see if we can get the UK to be on our side. I don't think so. I think they have an ally. I think I should check that before I try to get friends with them. Allied with Russia. Yep, I remember that now. Ottomans are also allied with Russia. Right. Um, there's a rule in this game, in this mod, to where a great power can't have more than one great power ally. Russia doesn't fucking care. They get the UK and the Ottomans. Hey mom, how come Russia gets to have two allies? I didn't even get one ally. That's because you're a little, you're a little bitch, Prussia, is the the response I'd imagine. Although no, wait, we do have the papal states, don't we? Don't we? We do. No, okay, so we get one. Bavaria wants a peace offer, and again, this is a thing where we're completely fine with this because we don't want fucking Bavaria in here. They, we want them to get spit out of their sphere, which will happen when we beat Austria. Having Bavaria out is perfect. This is merely negotiating for themselves, cuts them down to size, gives me cash money. It's exactly what I want to see. Austria wants the same thing. Fuck them. We have fighting in the streets. We're going to publish the liberals. Last time we did this, you know, before we went back in time, the liberals rose up, I think, right about now. Uh, they'll probably do that again. That's fine. Who fucking cares? Punish them. Um, we got a lot of troops here, right? Because we were killing people. They're going there. We're going to go kill them. We're going to kill them here instead. Where, where are you? Here? Kill him, please? Just kill him. That's the other theme. It's just, we'll just fucking kill him. I think that's the long-term plan, is kill every single Austrian soldier that exists. Gassiotis. Uh, you're, you're the one in the chat, so. Please turn off one-bit donation readouts. Um, it's been a long time coming. I'm not going to say that it won't happen, because it probably will. I expected it to happen a long time ago, but it's not that bad. You, you, like, I am surprised at how much self-control people have when it comes to these. Like, yeah, a, at the very beginning of a stream, there's like a spew of them. But then after that, everybody's content, you know, just like after you've had your wank, and then you don't need another, you're good. You know, you've, you've, ex, you've, you've expelled, and now you, you can just ruminate in your lowered sexual energy and you don't have to worry it's just there i don't enc encourage that kind of behavior that's wrong but you understand the analogy it's full metal alchemist it's not bad it's not bad not bad music does your dark wood play through go past part seven on youtube uh i don't remember what part it was but Partway through playing Darkwood, my save file got corrupted, and so I could not continue. So, I don't know if it was part 7. There's the Rebels, right on time. Um, oh, this looks like more. Uh, okay. Yeah, I don't know if it was part 7, but there there is some point at which they will stop. Because the game broke. And, which sucks, because Darkwood was a pretty fun fucking game. I might come back to it at some point. It was not, it was fun to play. Uh, but yeah. If you run into that, <laughs> that's, that's the answer. Um, what do we need? We've got all the army stuff, surprisingly. Usually I fall behind on that, but actually, Germany's pretty good at that. They're not good at culture. Did you know that, Germans? Hello, Germans. This game thinks your culture is garbage. You also don't know how to fucking build boats, which, hey... Uh, we need more money, coal gives us money, railroad gives us money, but costs money, so I'm gonna get the money that doesn't cost me money, if you get what I'm putting down here. Let's bring these guys together. 70,000 troops, that should be decent, uh, cleanup force. Oh, we've got 22,000 here that's gonna win that battle, that's nice. We've got 36,000 here that's... dying? Dead? Unmoraled? I'm not sure what's going on there. Bring these together. He can't move? No, okay. Alright, that's fine. Uh, okay. Honestly, despite how much of a mess this looks like, this is one of the cleaner wars I've done so far. Um, in, in Victoria 2, like, ever. I'm actually liking this. It's, it's... It's not overseas. I don't have to fucking worry about, like, oh, I don't have enough troops. Oh, oh I just can't fucking ship them over. 
I don't know if I can make it there in time. No, it's just like, oh, I have, I need someone here. Just bring him from down there, right? It's like, it's just, it's nice. It's simple. It's like, I just need to worry about the only continent that matters at the moment. Other than obviously, you know, this one. But fuck them. Uh, we don't like them. Unless we decide to like them. I'm not really sure where we'll go with that one. UK, would you like to like me? No. Yeah, that's, that's what I figured. The US probably has no allies. They're allied with France? What the fuck is with all these... Okay, no, that's whatever. Okay, go. Release countries to lower infamy when you need it. You can re-annex them when you become Germany. Okay. Alright. What do you... Okay. I'm, I'm gonna... Before I do that, I'll ask some clarifying questions. But for now, I'll just... Take your word on that one. Uh, rebellion in Carla, Spain, right? This is exactly what happened last time before we uh, went back in time. Um, Spain is not under Prussia anymore. We could gain two infamy to try and get them back. But we know now that it's not worth it. Spain sucks ass. Um, well, I mean, on one hand, they're pretty weak right now. On another hand, we do have enough infamy to do it. There's a, there's a sunk cost fallacy going on here. Where I'm thinking, like, we, we, it, we took, like, fucking ten infamy to take this place. You know, I'm willing to t sink another two in. So that I, uh, so that it's not a complete waste. But that's kind of like you're on the Titanic. You know, like, if an alternate history Titanic where they got a radio call from a boat nearby and said, like, Hey, bring some engineers to the Titanic so we can fix it. And then the engineers just fucking drown, too. Uh, that's, that's what I feel like is gonna go on here. We're gonna sink with the Spanish ships. But on the other hand, uh, you know. On the other hand, I'm stupid and I'm considering, you know, no, fuck them. I don't want them. I, it's too much of a hassle. I don't want them. I don't want them. Bye. Gives us an infamy. We need those back. In, a free infamy. Uh, that's fine. Um, that's okay. Uh, this needs to be this, and then... Where's our capital? Here? Okay, go there. Right away. Uh, this guy and this guy move up. We don't need that many more people sieging because it's mostly done. You can keep sieging, but when you're done, we'll move you up. That's fine. And then we'll just, we'll just let our allies do that. Our allies, I think, have got a pretty good handle on all this. Austria, I still don't want peace. And the idea here is that this continued war should fuck them up. Um, yes, yes, it is. It's fucking them up. You see this? They're ranked 12. You have to be in the top 8 to be a great power, which means, technically, they shouldn't be a great power right now. They're, number, they're in 8th place. They should drop... They're, be, they're below the fucking Papal States. They should drop out at any moment now to be replaced by Belgium. Which is another interesting one. Uh, yeah. But also, they're being beat out by Württemberg, two Sicilies, this fucking... Va okay. Guy in our sphere, that guy in their sphere, and yeah, them. Which, does that mean we could peace out now? Or do we want to wait for it to happen? Will it happen while they're at war, or is it a thing that doesn't take effect until the war's over? These are questions I don't know the answer to. Come together. Uh... Will this give me militancy or some shit if I say no? Good. I would have said no anyway, but it's good to know. Spain wants military access. I think we might try and just become allies with Spain. After all, we did paint our name across their country. Uh, it'd be a little strange if we didn't have some sort of relations. They would like an alliance. That's fine. We should have just done that in the first place instead of fucking trying to consume them. Just asked if they wanted to be friends <laughs> and had the same effect. But without breaking their government. What is this music? Leah Miskovsky. Mirror's Edge theme. I never played Mirror's Edge. I own it. But it's one of those ones I just never played. There's a good chance that Spain will become a great power. Okay, so that would be a problem, right? You have to keep them down long enough to sphere them, form North Germany, and take Alsace. Okay. Okay, so you're saying I need to really fuck them up. Okay. How do you have the square flags? Uh, that is from HFM. It by there are also smaller mods. Oh, good, more 
liberals. There are other mods that will also add just a square flag without adding all this bonus shit, but HFM adds the square flags along with, you know, a lot of other things. HFM is one of the better mods I've played so far. Not the best, I don't think. I think maybe Blood and Iron I like better. I think maybe even HPM I might have liked better. But for Germany, this one's going all right. I like it. It's certainly better than fucking Concert of Europe, that shit show that somehow got... I don't know how anyone plays that. It's garbage. Both of you go here. Oh, well, no. Meet up there first. Don't do that. That's good. That's fine. Okay, we need to... Ooh, that's a lot of... Okay, no, it's fine. Depression up... No! Uh, really? Okay, with the... Hmm. It's fine, because neither of these lose us... Uh, no, one of them does lose us prestige. But not a lot. Okay, so this should be... This might be fine. With the people seemingly ready to break down our doors, demanding constitutional reform, perhaps we should consider giving it to them. Some moderate reforms, allowing the masses their vote, but retaining ultimate power for the Prussian aristocracy and the Kaiser, should please them enough to dispel this rabble. For now. Give them limited reforms if it pleases them. Give 50 conservative in the upper house. Weighted universal. Gerrymandering. I take control over Berlin. Right, well, I was going to do that soon anyway. I hope. Uh, and people lose militancy. Or do it but undermine them, which gets reactionary in the upper house, meetings not allowed, take Berlin, liberals get a little bit pissed. That's fine. If that gets rid of this, this problem, that's fine. Okay, but it doesn't, does it not get rid of the, no, it doesn't get rid of, okay. Okay, uh, weird. Um, okay, all right, sure, that's fine. Fucking works, I guess. All right, let's move. Okay, they're starting. Okay, they're starting to d evaporate. Um. Okay, this wasn't a good idea. And there goes the Netherlands, of course, our good uh, puppet. There, our other mistake um, is now. Yeah, gonna gonna leave. Cut ba Baden Baden down to size merely for themselves. That's fine. Sure, Austria no. Austria is down to 15th place. They're dropping fast. Uh, it's not hard to beat most of the other mods. Oh, oh, you're saying most of the other mods are garbage. Yeah, okay. Talk about what you thought... <clears throat> excuse me. Of the movies you streamed. Well, uh... I streamed... What was it? Your name, which is the Japanese version of lit literally, literally, I'm not kidding, it's Freaky Friday. It is the movie Freaky Friday, where there's like a mother, I'm gonna turn this music down a little bit. In the original classic movie, the classic America, American cinema, uh, Freaky Friday, there's a mother and her daughter, and they're wacky and different, and they switch bodies, and that's goofy, and that's... That's the movie. Um, this is the same thing, but with two Japanese children who aren't related and live in different parts of the country. And then also some other stuff. Uh, let me read this real quick. National Settlement. They want to be allowed to join Prussia in perpetual union. Inherit hand... Ooh! Okay, well, that's fucking nice. I didn't expect that to happen so easy. That's a nice little... Okay, thanks. We can actually help the Netherlands here. No, we can't. That's 230,000. I can't do that. Uh, is, Hung is Hungary free? No, still at war with the Austrians. So we will send our troops over this way. Well, we'll send them down and then we'll send these ones over and maybe we'll run to Aust some, some Austrians we can harass. Right, so your name, that anime movie about the, free the Freaky Friday knockoff version was all right i've seen another movie by the same guy and it was better five centimeters per second it's a very similar movie it's better which is kind of disappointing in a way i like the ending better of this one maybe because it, it i don't want to spoil it i guess although probably anyone interested in watching it watched it with me the other day yep the netherlands is gone um we're gonna let them go so we can lose that prestige and just i mean infamy and just fucking See you, Netherlands. 
Nice flag. Uh, you want to form a... No? You hate me. Okay. It's fair. Yeah, it was okay. The movie was okay. And then we watched uh, Vertigo, which is a classic. Alfred Hitchcock movie. Very good. Very good movie. Didn't I had no idea what it was about going into it, and I think that helped. I didn't. I wouldn't have expected what it was about and how it went. Uh, and it was just a. It was a good fucking noir movie. Your name was shit. <laughs> it was. I won't. I'm not gonna say it's shit. It had a lot of inconsistencies. I'll get a little more. If you're worried about spoilers, you're probably not. I'll get a little more into it. Um, there's a. There's like a. There's a. There's some things that don't add up. Right? So these two people are going inside of each other's bodies whenever they go to bed. Now, it doesn't ever explain the fact that one of them should be sleeping while the other one is awake, but they both live in Japan with the same time zones. So it would never line up. They would always be awake and asleep at basically the same time. That's never addressed. Guess it's not important, really. But it doesn't make any sense, and there's a lot of other things that don't make sense. They don't. They never try and call each other until like towards the later half of the movie, and then it doesn't work because magic. But like they had never tried it before. They should have tried it. It's it's like obvious. You should. They should have fucking tried to just like write a note for themselves and say, "Hey, uh, I'm inside your body. Let's talk this out." And, like, they clearly didn't either, because they're, you might say, like, well, maybe they did, and it was off-screen, but they didn't, because then they meet in real life, and the girl's like, why'd you touch my tits? Which you think would have came up if they had talked ever before. So clearly they hadn't talked ever before. Um, there's just a lot of little inconsistencies like that, that add up. And if, you, if you're, like, a nitpicky, bullshit kind of person like me, it can, it can wear away at the movie. Otherwise, it's okay... You know, it's all right. It's it's hard for me to say great movie when there's a better version of the same movie because then spoilers kind of then it I mean, I didn't know it. Then it starts having time travel shit, which his other movie also has. And his other movie's better, and his other movie makes more sense. His other movie is more sad, which is probably what you want out of these kind of movies. So I d I don't recommend it unless you've seen 5 centimeters per second. If you've seen five centimeters per second, then yeah, you might like this is another movie to watch that you might enjoy. If you haven't seen five centimeters per second, just go watch that. I would recommend that. That's a very good movie. That's my those are my thoughts. I'd say Garden of Words is my favorite from that dude. Haven't seen Garden of Words. I've only seen these two movies, Your Name and Five Centimeters Per Second. Uh, we're getting rebels here. It's probably a good sign, but we need to stop that. Yeah, I've only seen those two, and five centimeters, five centimeters per second is definitely a better movie. It's it's also a different movie. I mean, it is, like, it's it's told differently. It's, like, sectioned into parts. It's not, like, the same movie, just better, but I'll say also, it's, disappo it's more disappointing, not just compared to the other movie, but also in the context of this is the most, the best-selling anime movie of all time, and it's supposed to be some sort of fucking amazing masterpiece. Why are we losing all of our troops? No, they're still around, right? Why, why are, huh? Why are all my troops disappearing? Do you notice this? Why is this a nine stack when it used to be like thousands? What's going on? Can't pay them? Can't pay them? Can't pay them? My, maybe I can't pay them. That makes some sense. Um, well, you know, in times of war, you really don't worry much about the economy or the administration, social spending, military spending's probably important still. It doesn't fucking help our... Yep. Alright, so we want to get out of this war probably pretty soon because all our troops are going to die. Um, Ru huh? Russia. Russia? Oh, these are sieged by Hungary. And Russia is at war with Hungary, which is still at war with the Austrians. Hmm? It's 
So the Austrian, so the Hungarians tried to break free from Austria. They're doing an okay job. They're still at war with Austria, but nothing is sieged of theirs. And Russia's invading? Or did Austria, or did fucking Hungary think this was a good time to... This is the Hungarian Revolution. Austria's losing. Perfect. Venetian Revolution. Austria's losing. Perfect. Very quiet JoJo music in my ear now. Turn that up, I guess. Uh, Russian intervention in Hungary. They would like to cut Hungary down to size. But why? They've got too much infamy? <laughs> what? They've got, they've got none. What could you... Why would you care? Uh, <laughs> okay. <sighs> What's your favorite movie ever? For some reason, I don't understand it. I've seen this movie probably like four or five times now. I still don't know why I like it so much, but Gattaca. Gattaca is my favorite movie. I love that movie. I love the way it looks. I love the theme of just like, yeah, genetics influence people's lives a lot. But if you just like shout and swim out into the middle of the ocean and, and fight with your brother, you can overcome it through the spirit of the will sort of shit. I love that movie. I guess I do know why I love that movie. Uh, that's why. It's a good, I, I, it's good. It's good. Gattaca is my favorite movie. Um, military access, sure, whatever. Austria, sh is it time to... Austria is now at... Le <laughs> Ooh. I gotta turn this down a little bit, I think. Austria is now at, at rank 56. Tell me if the music's too loud or whatever. It's never fucking accurate to what I'm hearing. Uh, it's probably time to peace out with Austria, right? They're rank 56. Their military score is 10, which means they still have troops around. There they are. We could go kill them, maybe. I guess that would be something we could do in addition. Um, we don't have a lot of troops to to do that with, but but if, um, we might not even be able to do that. No, we got 16,000 down here. Okay. Well, yeah, well, I guess we'll try to kill the rest of the Austrians. Let's bring all our guys together, just for simplicity's sake. We'll kill them. That should lower their military score a bit more. Their industry is one. <laughs> Can't get much fucking lower than that. And their prestige has disappeared. Which is the main thing. So I think I think we're about done with Austria. I think Austria is about fucked. Um, and if we finish off the rest of their troops, which I assume this is everything they have left. Um, if we kill them, I I think Hungary's gonna get go free. Which will just seal their fate. Because that's a big portion of their country that's just gonna fucking zip, zip out of there. Fucking poof, disappear. Um, until they get gobbled up by the Russians or whatever's going on there. <clears throat> okay. Yeah, I think we've actually turned this around. I think, uh... San Marino wants an alliance. San Marino. The Republic of San Marino? I would love an alliance with you, San Marino. Yeah. Yeah. Venice? I'd like, yeah. Free, independent Venice. We'll probably, uh, sphere them because maybe they would come in with Germany. I don't think so. Probably not, no. But, be neat. Um, you coming down here? Oh, we're dying here. Uh, now we can't get them. Nope, now they're not. Now they're outside of that territory. I can't get them. And it looks like the Saxons are. Wait, no, wait. What? Saxons are our guys. Oh, we can't get them. Oh, okay. Let's help the Saxons. That Saxons pussied out. Okay. Yeah, let's just finish off these troops. Ah, uh, we don't really. Now we can't go? Now we can't. The fuck is going on? Why could I do it a second? Okay, Austria, fine. We're done. Uh, let's, check, let's do our research. Okay, we've got new research. We've got prestige. We want prestige. We want to make sure we're always the best. It's, I guess it's not really that important, though, because we've got so much prestige. 
We'll grab it anyway. It's, it's nice to have. No, we want nationalism and imperialism. We want that immediately. Okay. Somebody tell me if this is bad. If this is a bad idea, but I think this is what we want to do is, is take out Austria. Bye, yeoman. Okay, bye. Oh, this is like every opening to JoJo. Yeah, I'm gonna skip. I'm gonna skip. The volume's fucked up on it, too. Max power initial D. Okay, this I can do. Bye, yeoman. Uh, uh, bye. Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay, Austria. You are rank 58. If somehow they could r rise up to a great power status in the next, like, what, 10, 20 years? I'll be impressed. I'll let them have it. But no, we're gonna we're gonna demand reparations. We could maybe add something else at this point. Um, add to sphere would cost four. Kind of not worthwhile since we can just add to the sphere pretty quickly after. I think. Free people, I don't care. Release puppet, I don't care because they won't be a great power. It'll be released anyway. Acquire state, I don't care. That's gonna happen anyway. Cut down to size. Reparations? Don't we have that? We have that. Except that's not me. I won't get them. I don't care. This is fine. Okay. Austria's done. Austria is now a civilized nation. Not a great power. Bavaria, also not a... Also very low ranked, which is important. Bavaria sometimes can overcome that kind of thing. Um, they're not going to. So now, we look at sphere. Sphere of influence. Here's us. Here's what we need. Looking good. Let's put this at a... We can't do it yet. Because we got a truce. Okay, Hungary. Hungary we can. I think Hungary is important. I don't know if Hungary is important. Bavaria. Probably can't. Truce, right? That's how this is going to go? Yeah, okay. Um, uh, Venice? Venice is good. Okay, we'll do Venice. Uh, Wurttemberg, they're all, they're all gonna be truces. Not Wurttemberg, okay. Fair. That one we have, that one's Wurttemberg, this is Baden. Can't do it. Bavaria. Hosdarmstadt, can't do it. Harmstadt, yes, okay. Uh, Rus. Can do it, okay, perfect. And I think that's it. Oh, little guy here. Nope, that's more of Austria. That's more of Austria. Why is there two Austrias? Oh, it counts as Hungary? Okay. If you say so. So we've, ac we've accomplished our goal. That, that war was actually ex extreme success. Uh, now we just need to get on sieging them, which will take a little bit because we have to wait for the truce to go away, which is... It's a good thing we really fucked them up. Is there anything else we want to do here? I don't think so. I think we got to wait for this. We need nationalism, and we need all those spheres. So, yeah. Okay. Uh, you want annex Hungary when you form Germany. You won't. Okay, you won't be able to annex Hungary when you form Germany because they aren't in the German culture group. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I see what you're saying. So, uh... So there's no reason to sphere them, is what you're telling me? That's fine. I mean, with that in mind, I'm going to change my priorities a bit. We've got... Hungary is a low priority. This one's a high priority. This one's a high priority. This one is also low. How does that divvy it up? You know what? Fuck it. We're, we'll just do for the ones that actually matter. We don't want to miss anything in Germany here. All these are ours too, right? Right? Yeah, very good. Very good. This we're working on, or... Yes, okay. Oh, Schwarzberg? No, we have that. Okay, yeah, nice. Uh, so now, we need to burn some of our infamy off. Savoy is, uh... Not... Okay, S Sardinia Piedmont broke in half after our war with them on our side. Which means they're not our ally anymore, I assume. Um... We're still allied with two Sicilies. We have a lot of alliances. We have a... <laughs> we have a lot of alliances. Okay. We're allied with the Pope still? Yes. 
Allied with two Sicilies and the Pope. The Pope is a great power. Yep, so that's our great power. Belgium has joined the ranks of the great powers of the world. Welcome, Belgium. We need to get rid of our... We need to demobilize. That's really important. Should have done that. Um, the first Beethoven Fest. Neat. Sounds like a hoot. Um, we're losing a lot of money, but soon to be not so much money. Okay. They The rebels have determined this is the time to strike. It was probably a good idea. They probably are... Well, they don't have any of that. They're probably very smart in striking right now. But small numbers. But we have smaller numbers. Six. That's the number. Uh, yeah, okay. Um. Alright, what do you want? You're just some Jacobins. We'll just fucking pass. We can't pass anything. Okay. Alright, so not that. Uh... We'll start building some troops. We want... I don't know, like one, two, three... What's our composition like in the one thing we have? We only have that one, right? Yep. Infantry, 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 artillery, artillery. Not bad. Uh, we'll build... You know, like... Uh, ten. No. Eight. And... Six. Just get rid of one of these. Get rid of couple of these for a, a Hussar and an Engineer, and that's probably fine. Oh, is that a very long... Oh, I see. I didn't notice until just now. If you... You would annex Hungary if you spread... Aust if you sphered Austria-Hungary, right? I think so. So maybe if Austria gets Hungary back, we'll be in luck? They didn't get Austria back. Okay. I mean, they didn't get Hungary back. Sphere some African countries you want. That's a good idea. I'll do that uh, after we finish the German ones. But the thing is, by the time we finish the German ones, there might be more German ones. Can we control the troops of... Right, the Netherlands aren't puppets anymore. Okay, this is that autist... <laughs> that autistic cover of uh, Duvet again. Duvet. You guys need to stop recommending quiet songs, though, because I gotta go and turn them up. It, it slows the pace. Do we have a very important? I really enjoy the fact that the Netherlands is helping me with my rebellion here. I don't know why they're doing that, but it, okay, we that was a mistake. <sighs> okay, all right. Oh, yep, yeah, that's uh, that's another. We might become liberal here. Which shouldn't have an effect on most things. Uh, except our money-making ability and our... Oh, we can get rid of our debt. Let's do that before the liberals come into power because that's not gonna... We're not gonna have that opportunity again. Uh, yeah, probably they're gonna lower tariffs. They're gonna... Taxes will probably stay the same. They seem to be okay with taxes. But they'll probably lower tariffs. We'll probably lose a bunch of money. We'll lose a bit of prestige. But I think... It won't be that bad. And yeah, it's basically impossible for us to defeat them right now because we have one singular soldier. One, one, yep. Let's move out of the way. Let's move, let's move to where the Netherlands are, the Dutch, as some sort of protection. And we'll have all of our people meet up here. I think we have another spot here. Turn that off. Um, if any of them survive and make it through here. I like that also that the Danish seem to be helping, maybe. Or just standing around and helping by accident. San Marco is still at war with Austria. And it seems like they might actually lose. Because they have six and Austria has ten. <laughs> it's not a big difference, but... How long until this truce is over? Five years? Four. Four years. Four and a half. Yeah, so it was five. Okay. <clears throat> okay, well, it's going good. Uh, after this rebellion is over, we'll build up our army. We'll maybe turn our sights to something overseas. Or maybe we'll just let our infamy fall down so we can definitely get Germany to happen. Because someone was telling me I need a lot of that. Was that Hanover, Nash? Okay. Alright, Jacobins is one thing. 
Hanover Nationalists is something else entirely. That's that's an actual problem that we need to fix. Liberals can deal with. Losing Hanover, I can't deal with that. Um, there aren't many of them. Shit. Do we mobilize? Yeah. Yeah, we gotta mobilize. I don't like this. But we have to. Yeah, there's... Fi okay, fucking thank you. Okay, this'll do it. Except that, well... These are Jacobins. I don't care. We'll let them take the capital. F fuck them. But it's, it's these guys that we need to... We cannot let that stand. Are you gonna move there? Are you, go are you going to move there? Thank you. Reactionaries. That's also fine. Um, I don't think the... Okay, yeah, it's fine. Kill them. Who are these here? Uh, move, move out of there. Are those, are those nationalists? Yes. We'll get them in a second. Okay, they're dead. Perfect. Come together here. You're taking attrition. Doesn't matter. Don't worry about it. Go here. Kill them. Okay, rebellion basically won. There's another Hanover, another Hanover there, but they're small. Small and separate. New liberal regime. Okay, now there's one thing I need to make sure because I'm not entirely sure about it. We lost 56 prestige. 59. That's real bad. Um, there's no doubt about that. Freedom has prevailed. That's bad. There's no doubt about that. Uh, do we still have our spheres? We do. Okay. <laughs> That's what I was worried about. If we still have that, there's no problem. Choose a trade policy. We have to have some shitty one, right? Less maximum tariffs. No. No. Never. No. I'm not doing that. Oh, that's fucking bad. Okay. Alright. Um, let's let's kill the rest of these rebels, because all the ones that are left should be pretty bad. Except the reactionaries, but I have to... Focus on Hanover first. Hanover's way more important. Focus on killing the Hanover people. Then we'll decide whether or not we want to let the, rest, the reactionaries do what they want. Because I wouldn't mind becoming more reactionary. Because then we could make money again. You stupid fucking liberals. You cuck me every time with this garbage. I can't pay that. Look, they lowered taxes too. What kind of fucking liberals are you? Lowering taxes. How am I supposed to run this country? I need that money. We were just in the green for like a t three months. Robert Schumann. Thanks for the prestige. Thank you very much. Won't help. Not gonna help. Come together. Realist literature. Okay, I think all the Hanover people are dead. That's good. The reactionaries disappeared. That's bad. We have reactionaries who might rise up, but probably not. The liberals are only in charge for no reason. We can hold an election and then they'll stop being in charge. That's a nice fucking start. Maybe some sort of conservative reactionary coalition. Quick road to zero prestige. It's fine. Okay? We're good. Now... Now we demobilize. Okay? Then we start building our army up again. The one we tried to build up and it, it didn't work. Let's try this again. What do we have? 2-2. Two, 1. Two, That's it. 1-2-1. One, one. Okay. Uh, give me just infantry. And, uh, and an army. Yep. Okay, you over here, start sieging that. Uh, you here, start sieging that. Get rid of that. Belgium wants an alliance. Belgium is a great power. Uh, Belgium sucks. <laughs> <clears throat> Belgium is a great power and they suck ass. They are the worst possible ally you could have for a great power. They have three military score. The Netherlands could kill them. The Netherlands is garbage, by the way. They're ranked 34, but they could kill them. Don't want them. Fuck you, Belgium, for even suggesting that. Also, why would they accept that? I'm not allied with the Papal States, right? I lost all my alliances. Right. The Papal States kind of sucks, too. These numbers are lower than I expected, though, so maybe that's it. Russia would not accept. Right. They, they still have alliances. UK still has alliances. France? France still has alliances. Ottomans still has alliances. The Papal States would probably accept Okay, we'll take the Papal States, that's fine. We'll take two Sicilies, too. Which is in the sphere of the Papal States? They would not... Okay. 
Savoy has grown? Oh, okay. Interesting. So Sardinia Piedmont got split in half, but then the Savoy half got bigger? Um, San Marco would probably accept. They seem like a decent choice. We still have all of our little, our little allies, right? Yes. Yes, okay, nice. Bavaria, Austrians. Yep, that's a problem. You guys keep having songs of varying volumes. You can appoint the party. Oh. Oh, you're right. Yeah, I probably could. Yeah, okay. Well, we're having an election. Belgium just became freer, which sucks for them. Take a quick drink. Savoy. Savoy, you kind of suck right now. Come back to me later. Also, I've noticed we've dropped two places. We're now being beat by the U.S. and Russia. We were above them. Now we're not. Uh, we need to fix that, which means we'll probably go for impressionalism right after this. Makes me regret not going for it right away. That's fine. Full speed, please. As we build up our army and everything. Okay, everything's gone there. Come here. Here. Yeah, here. Wait, what? That's part of... What? Saxony? Where did you get Saxony from there? There's no fucking Saxony there. Stop that. Okay. This is looking fine. We can add to our sphere. Perfect. We need that one. We need that one. Now we have them. Good. What else do we need? Probably just a bunch of garbage we can't get right now. Spain wants an alliance. That's fine. I like Spain. Uh, let's piss off the... These guys. Rouse? Yes. Okay. All right. Yeah, I'm liking how things are going. I didn't. I, I said that I was going to turn this around. I half expected it not to happen at all. Um, it's happening, though. We probably can't get an alliance. 